living here now. It's a movie about Bloomington, Indiana, so naturally the people that live there get first chance to see what they look like through the eyes of Hollywood. The picture is called Breaking Away, and this is its world premiere. The stars are all present, chauffeured to Indiana University's auditorium, disguised as a movie theater, and all the IU dignitaries came to see how the university will be portrayed to the world on the big screen. 4,000 people showed up to see the premiere, the lights and glamour of it all making it a special event. The movie itself is based on the little 500 bike race that's held every year. The author of Breaking Away is Steve Tesich, a 1965 IU graduate who rode in the highly competitive bike race 14 years ago. The director of the movie is Peter Yates, who also directed The Deep and Bullet. Yates tells me he thinks the movie is the best he's ever done. It's appropriate that the world premiere of the movie Breaking Away should take place here in Bloomington because this is where it all began. The filming of the movie on location at the Indiana University campus in Bloomington took place last summer. Filming took place in several areas of the city. There was even a staged replica of the Little 500 race at the old football stadium. Where there's movie making, there is money being spent. Bloomington got quite a boost from the film economically. Even townspeople and college students were used as paid extras. What did they think of the finished product? I liked it very well. We really enjoyed it. I resented the animosity they felt that we had between the townspeople you know, and our student body. You don't never, think it's really there? I've never felt no. anything like that. It's great. I got to see myself in the movies. The picture is due for general release across the country later this summer. From Bloomington, Brian Traring for the News, Channel 6.